A little while ago, I needed to pull a report in QuickBooks that allowed me to view line-by-line -line details for several different transactions across many different transaction types. Although that is available in QuickBooks Online, I could not find a report close enough in QuickBooks Desktop. And it was a little frustrating. But after a bit of digging around, I was able to build a report using the check detail report that gave me what I was looking for. And I know that I'm not the only one that needs a report that gives you that level of detail line by line for every transaction, um, showing the accounts and everything. So I wanted to show you how I built this report and uh, hopefully it will be useful to you as well. So you can find the check detail report under reports, banking, check detail. I've already got one open with some date ranges to work at. And as you can see, the check detail is really designed to show you the check, which bank account it came out of, and then the line-by-line -line details related to that transaction. What I did is you can come up to Customize, go to your Filters tab, and remove the bank account, the amount filter, and the transaction types. So it leaves the detail level and the date. Once I've got that, I can hit OK. And now I've got that check still with its bank account and the item that it was related to and the expense account that it went to. But also I've got like a journal entry that went to the checking account. I've got a journal entry that went to line of credit and interest. I've got accounts payables accounts. I've got retained earnings accounts, uh, inventory adjustment transactions. There's just a lot that's here, purchase orders. And so you, if you look at these, like with the company, with the journal entries, I've got a debit here, credit, debit, credit, 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 debit. So I can see all of the different details that are related to these transactions. For my inventory adjustments, here are all of the items that were related to it. Um, if we had some invoices in here, or like this purchase order, you can see all of the items that were purchased on that purchase order. And you can even see the bills that were associated with that purchase order. So there's a wealth of information that you can glean from this. Um, in my case, to get the, the report a little more accurate, I actually filtered into just AR accounts, just AP accounts, kind of grouped them together so that I knew that, that I could trust the data I was looking at. But um, it's, it's fairly customizable and gives that level of detail that isn't normally found in uh, a QuickBooks desktop report uh, like you would find on QuickBooks Online. So if you've been struggling with it like I have, hopefully this will be useful to you and um, you can use it in the future.